we're going to talk about horizontal and vertical lines. So horizontal and vertical lines, those are lines, a horizontal line is one that goes uh, across from left to right with no steepness, and a vertical line is one that goes straight up and down with no slope. Uh, horizontal line, we'll start with those. So horizontal lines. Horizontal line. Uh, these are given by the equation. If we have a, a point that's on a horizontal line, let's just say a comma b, it would be given by y equals b. A horizontal line is given by y equals b. Uh, also, something interesting about horizontal lines is that they all have the same slope. The slope of any horizontal line would be zero. And we can verify this because if we're given the equation y equals 2, if we were to graph this line, y equals 2. So we're just looking where in the coordinate plane does y equal 2. y equals 2 up here at this point. That point happens to be 0, 2. That's the y-intercept. But y also equals 2 here at 1, 2. And it equals 2 at 2, 2. And it equals 2 at negative 1, 2. So it's all of these, and it's this horizontal line. It's, so it's parallel to the x-axis, but it's two units above the x-axis. So this would be the, the graph of y equals 2, all the points where the y-coordinate is 2. You'll notice that this one is missing the x-coordinate because it would be just, uh, it doesn't matter what x is because y is 2. If you wanted to confirm the slope, we found a few points. We have 0, 2 given here. We have negative 1, 2 given here. The slope would be 2 minus 2 over 0 minus negative 1. That's 0 over 1, which is 0. Any horizontal line, not just y equals 2, y equals 7 would have a slope of 0. y equals negative 1 million would have a slope of y equals 0. And they're all given by y equals b. For vertical lines, if we have a point that's on a vertical line, a, b, the equation of the vertical line would be x is equal to a. You'll notice here that when we write a vertical line, we don't have a y variable. Um, every vertical line, there's two ways that you can say this. You can either say that the slope is undefined, or you can say that there is no slope. No slope. Or you can say that the slope is undefined. Undefined slope. So a very special circumstance when we deal with vertical lines. For example, if we have x equals 2, if we were to graph that, we're looking for all of the places in the coordinate plane where x is equal to 2. So that's every ordered pair that's 2, comma, and then whatever y coordinate we choose to use. So here at 2, 0, x is equal to 2. Up here at 2, 2, x is equal to 2. Down here at 2, negative 4, x is equal to 2. So that would be a vertical line. It's parallel to the y-axis, you might notice, but it's two units shifted to the right. And then if you were to test out the slope here, so this was the point 2, 2, this was the point 2, 0. If we were to determine the slope, that would be 2 minus 0 over 2 minus 2. That's 2 over 0. That's mathematically improper. That indicates to us that it's undefined or that there's no slope. 